On Friday though, Friday night sometime, they posted some more things about this. Good day, Dragon Rider. As data miners have guessed, we are indeed working on Dragon Riding outside of the Dragon Isle. There it is, from their own words, from the Blizzard Blue words. And broadening the set of mounts that can be, that can dragon ride. All right, there you have it. We all knew that this will happen, but now it's actually from the source. We will be able to mount other mounts and dragon ride them. We will also be able to dragon ride outside Dragon Isle. Our initial work on this can be seen in the Fractures of Time game files. And yeah, that's why they say as data miners have, have guessed. But that feature will not complete or featured in the live game until later in Dragon. So in 10.15, it's not coming out. That's what they're saying. And since they can't give us a date because they're trying all this stuff out, they don't know. But as it look for now, it won't happen in 10.15. As we continue to develop the game in this way, we expect there to be many examples in the future of content that is a work in progress, becoming visible to data miners in test environments. We will probably see quite a lot of different mounts that that they will call something something dragon riding and in the data mining files you can see that so basically they don't know yet which one's gonna be they're trying stuff out that, that's how I understand this they're trying stuff out you will see a lot of names you will see a lot of mount names that has some kind of dragon riding code on them so even though you see that it might not be actually be that it will be ha happening but it also can mean that it will happen we intend to announce the contents of any given patch in our official post about that patch Old world, more mounts, and flying styles. Okay, what do we have here? Ashlyn. There are two new spells related to flying in 10.15. Flight is currently enabled, and dynamic flight is currently enabled. Oh! Hey! That is cool! So basically, you can choose if you want to dragon ride or not with those mounts. Just a click away. Boom, boom. Dragon ride, not dragon ride. Wait, I wonder if you have to do it on ground or out in the air. Because what if you use dragon riding, and then you like you go up in the air, and then be like, ah, shit! dude i'm out of vigor boom normal flying get vigor back you will never have to land ever all right cool 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 Temple 5 adds you many many new dragon races achievements in kalimdor and eastern kingdoms meaning you'll be able to use in those uh, continents okay so bronze gold silver and advance in both in both locations quite a lot of them okay list of mounts with dragon riding animations below is the extensive list of affected mounts okay swift nether drake so it's this one onyx nether drake hey okay i'm seeing a pattern here at the moment all these drakes that are uh um, that, that looks like this all these type of ones similar to the one we saw like that kind of skeleton of the drake kind of drake you know but do we have anyone else that is not nether wing here we have nether drake nether 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 okay azure i think that's same the same skeleton no yeah it's the same skeleton oh man imagine imagine if proto drake skeleton would be up man i really hope so let's let's continue twilight drake that's the same skeleton black black drake's game skeleton proto drake oh my god proto drakes Hey! Hey! Proto Drakes has been my favorite fly mounts for so long, man. So, black, blue, red, time lost, plagued, violet, albino, green, iron bound, rusted. Hey, hey, hey. So, it's all these. Oh, man! Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Onyx and Drake, that's the same skeleton as uh, the other one, right? Yeah, that's a, that's the same skeleton. So, all, all these type of mounts. Ice bound, frost brood, vanquisher. No way. What? Gonna drag over this bad boy. Oof. Okay. All right. Bloodbath Thrust Brood Vanquisher. That's the other one, right? Yeah, that's the other one. The ten, tw 10 player and the 25 player one. Uh, Volcanic Stone Drake. Volcanic Stone Drake. Drake of the East Wind. Yeah, these two bad boys. And I guess West is there. Yeah, West is there. Drake of the North is also there. And South. Sandstone Drake is there. Hear me out now. We know that in Dragonflight, you can activate so that if you dragon ride and you're in a party with someone, they can ride with you, right? They'll turn into a dragonling, like a dragon baby, and just fly with you, right? Now, hopefully it's gonna be the same when you are in Candle. Now, what if you turn into a sandstone drake, someone jumps up and rides on you, and you have it activated so that someone can actually ride with you? So that will be two players can can ride along them. That would be really cool. That would be like the first dragon ever where more than one per player can can ride along with you. Purple blood firehawk firehawks as well. I mean, okay, we don't know what we'll be able to do because you remember remember the blue post we read. But like a pre warning, 
You will see all this stuff. Doesn't mean that, you know, all this stuff will come out. They're, they're trying it out. Yeah, these will be cool. Fellfire, Corrupted, and Pure. Okay, three. Okay, okay. This one can get, the Fellfire can get, and the Pure. Oh, that's a Firelands one. Vicious Gladiator. Oh, yep. Ruthless Gladiator, Twilight Drakes. The Experiment one. That's the one you get from um, Dragon Soul. Galakras is there. Small Galakras. Dread Raven. Oh, that's cool. That might mean that this skeleton, if it works, all these type of uh, skeleton mounts will uh, will be av available. All right, so they actually have quite a lot of different skeletons. So they data mined uh, all these mounts. Those data mined all these achievements. And when did they do this? 16 days ago. All this was data mined 16 days ago. That was two builds ago. So wh what does all this mean? It means that we might get quite a lot of flying mounts as, as dragon flying mounts. That's what it means. This skeleton they haven't tried. We will see more stuff. As you continue to develop the game in this way, you expect there are many examples in the future of content that is a work in progress becoming visible data miners. So yeah, we might actually see stuff like this one popping up as a dragon riding mount as well. I don't think we, we will be seeing these kind of mounts. Everything that has to do with like horses and stuff like that, I don't think there will be at all. This one, most likely we will see later on on the data mining as a as a testing smoldering ember worm hey that one is pop up man if they add a vanquisher they have to add this one as well yeah and these kind of mounts no what about what do you think about nether rays i could see nether rays popping up there because it has the same type of you know movement as the other ones oh the grave wing hey that would be badass serpents it's hard. Serpent is hard. I think wings are needed. That's that's the problem. Because you know when you when you dive, when you get vigor, it's not only about looking at the wind. It's also looking at the wings. Like in my case, I actually look at the wings when I when I know I'm getting I'm gaining vigor. Because the wings like they close up a little bit, you know, when they when they go faster. But it would actually be really cool dragon ride these serpents. Yeah, griffins will be cool. Griffins they have to have griffins. If they're gonna have griffins, they ha they're gonna have the the horde one as well.